Good day everyone! My name is Richard Angelo Luzon from the Bachelor of Science and Civil Engineering and for today, we will deal a specific topic in physics named the center of mass. So, we will solve a sample problem involving that subject. The problem is, three objects are located in a coordinate system. Determine the center of the mass. So, in this particular problem, we are tasked to find the center of mass of the coordinate system which is in here it involves three objects we will denote it as object one object two and object three as you can see the objects involved in the system have different masses from one another thus they have a distinct mass observing in this value or figure we can also determine that there is a distance between object 1, 2, and 3. The distance between object 1 from object 2 is 0.5 meters and the distance between object 3 and object 2 is 1 meters. We should also take note that the three objects are situated in the x-axis, which means that the y and z-axis will have a value of 0. Therefore, they are insignificant in solving this kind of problem because we will just deal in the x-axis. That being stated, we will utilize this formula. The formula is x sub cm or center of mass is equals to m sub 1 multiplied by x sub 1 plus m sub 2 multiplied by x sub 2 plus m sub 3 multiplied by x sub 3 all over the total mass of the three objects. So this is the formula that we will use. Moreover, we should also note that there are some sources that uses CG or center of gravity instead of center of mass. Either way, they just are synonymous. We should also take note that we will denote the first quadrant as the positive side because wala namang ibinigay sa atin na reference point therefore we can freely choose kung saan yung magiging reference point natin and in this case we will choose the y-axis as the reference point therefore the other side will become negative in value the other one or the quadrant one will be the positive value so now we will start to solve this problem substituting the values given we have the value of m sub 1 which is 5 kilogram. We know that the position is 0 0.500 meters. We will input negative 0 0.5 meters because it opposes the reference point na inilagay natin. Kaya naging negative yung value niya. Then we will substitute 2 kg because yun yung mass ng mass 2. At 0 meters yung kanyang x sub 2 because it is situated in the reference point. Therefore, ito yung origin nung ating reference point which have a value of 0. Then, we will also substitute 4 kg in place of the mass 3. And we know that there, there are a 1 meter distance. Kaya 1 meter yung inalagay natin. Doon naman sa total mass is we will just put the value of the masses of the three objects and we will sum it up. By calculating, we will arrive at this value which is 0 0.1364 meters. So, in interpreting this value, nakasituate to with respect dun sa origin na pinili natin to the right. Kaya yung magiging itsura niya is Something like this. The 0 0.1364 meters is situated somewhere in this place. Dahil with respect dun sa pinili nating reference point to the right. So, ganyan lang natin isosolve yung ganitong type of problem. We should also note that the kilogram has been cancelled. That's why we are left with meters. 